Right, I'm playing Hearthstone again. It has been a while uh, since I recorded it, but I figured I could use this as a uh, sort of little little uh, moment to sort of talk about what's going on. I have one small announcement with the channel for a series that I've not started editing yet, which is just basically in Warframe. I seem to have lost an entire hour of footage. I don't know where it is. I have a feeling that it's been overwritten somehow. We'll get into the details of that eventually. Possibly in the comments. Uther but anyway. What I'm basically doing I here is I am I am going light. to earn the coins so that I can so that I can get the League of Explorers first wing because I don't want to spend money. I already bought one wing of Nax because they're going to be removing it eventually and I was worried I wouldn't be able to purchase uh, it before they they did it with coins. Um, yeah. So, I'm just doing some rank mode. In fact, the reason I'm recording now is because I had a really good game last time. Anything worth playing? Not particularly. Uh, I had a really good game where the guy basically had Ysera on the field at some point. He had one of the big guys from League of Explorers on the field. He had all these basically legendaries. And my only legendary in this deck, uh, from what I can remember, is Ragnaros? I think it's just Ragnaros. Uh, I probably should have hit that with my face, but that's okay. We can do that next turn. Um, I'm pretty sure my only... Oh, do I have Khan... I might have Khan Bloodhoof in this deck as well. But the only one I ever really play is Ragnaros. But anyway, I had a really cool game. Um, and I thought, I wish I recorded that. And so here I am. I've not versed another Paladin in a while. So... For justice. Uh, we don't need to waste a divine shield on a, on a little guy. There we go, that's that. Go. So yes, uh, there's going to be a section of Warframe, if anyone cares, where it doesn't quite line up. Uh, because we lose an entire section of us playing the Jordas Precept. Um, which is annoying. Oof, well played. Making use of that cloning goo. Um, could. Does that warrant a consecrate? It might warrant a consecrate. Hello, Ragnaros. Yeah, I think it warrants a consecrate. We'll consecrate. We'll hit her with our face. And then we'll hit him with the sword. With the, not the sword, the little guy. So, yes. Missing an entire hour of Warframe. And that annoys me, but. All in all, Warframe's not a game where the story is particularly important. I don't even know what the story is. I just skipped through it because I don't want to. Uh, Ready, sir. I don't want to play this. I don't want to listen to a story. I want to shoot aliens, and that is my approach to the game. Now, what else can I talk about to fill this? Uh, I enjoy the bit. The you know what? Let's get rid of that. I think he's going to run that into that. That's going to be okay, because he spent five on it. He spent five on it. And so that's sort of a even thing. I know that anyone who plays Hearthstone is going to be like, Ugh. So bad. But at the same time, I think anyone who plays Hearthstone is not going to be watching this. So that's okay. What else is news? Uni starts up uh, next month. So that'll definitely slow content being made. However, it probably won't slow content being edited. Uh, because that can't possibly go any slower right now. Uh, because I'm not <laughs> I'm not doing it. I really should edit more, but... Mm. It's sort of like halfway between... Can't be bothered and... Oh, that's a good play. Well played. Good, good play. What a play. The play is so real. So yeah. The thing with editing is that it takes a lot longer uh, than many people think, unless I'm doing it wrong. But you see, so there's, you can either basically just snip, just chop it up every 15 minutes and pop it up there. But, like, the way I look at it... Oh, damn you! The way I look at it is that... What is he going to do? Is that I like to put in a little bit more sort of 
personality to the edits, you know, have it not be just straight footage, have, of course, cuts because it gets boring, and, you know, maybe funny, funny little things in the middle, like in Fallout 4, when I did that little montage of all the times I said copper. That was, that was some good times, you know, we had a good time then. What is he going to do? Okay, and then what, run your 3-3 three, three into it? I don't know if that's a good move, but at the same time, I don't know what else he could have done. Uh, probably not much, given what he did. Um, uh, we'll play Shreds, we'll play Mustard for Battle. Love me some Mustard for Battle. Battle Mustard, 10 out of 10. This is my responsibility. See, I don't know if I should just leave it, but he might buff it more. This is my responsibility. For justice. Okay, and there's no point attacking him because he's going to run that into that. That's no a better trade for him, and he's going to think that's the better deal. However, that's what I want him to do. Or he's going to buff it more. Oh no, he's going to make it hard. Okay. Wait, does resummon mean, like, including buffs? Does it mean including buffs? Hmm. Let me just think about this. Not including buffs. That's okay. Kalthasad, hey. We could play Stormwind. And not kill Kalthasad. We could play Frostwolf. And not kill Kalthasad. I wonder, indeed, we could play Ragnaros and might kill Kalthasad. Do you know what? By fire be purged. And we're just going to attack battle. face, because I can't think the of a battle. better way for this to go, to be honest. TBH. For justice. If we hit face, we hit face. If Kel'Thuzad dies... Kel'Thuzad didn't die. But... Um, I'm going to play this off like that's better. Well, I mean, to be honest, he's probably not very willing to kill Kalthazard, so he would have rather buffed his older alderman, alderman, mm. what's his name, keeper of alderman. He would have rather killed his alderman, like buffed it, ran oh, into Ragnaros, and then. Oh, that's gonna be annoying as hell. Unless my get, I get my owl, and I can silence, silence our good friend. Not on my oh. bench. I'm gonna take eight to the face. Really, like the only way I can get around this is if this card is an owl. It's not an owl. Unless I need to get my eyes checked again, that's not an owl. Uh, we kill this guy, he dies, there's then a taunt. We don't have the tools to get rid of the. God damn it. I hate this. I hate oh, Kel'Thuzad so much, way. and that's why I'm trying to get him later, eventually. As when I eventually purchase Nax. I should have buffed him. I should have put the shield on him. Why didn't I do that? That would have been a great play. Can I please have a Humility Consecrate this next turn? Can I draw two cards for no reason? I don't think I can. You'll notice this time there's no face cam in the Hearthstone because I uh, don't have a good wonder. webcam. Okay, so what? He's going to run that into. Okay. If I can, if I can get humility and consecrate out there, then we're good. But I can't think of a way that could happen. If I'm completely honest. Um, oh, that's annoying. It's like he's got a lot of horses now. You know the um the horse that what his face gets warlock. The horse that keeps resumming itself, and you just basically run it into something every time. But God, it's not gonna do it. Jeez. How 
many minions can you have at the board at any one time? I think it's eight. So if this next card is a Stormwind Champion, we're not in for a good time. Oh, no, okay, it's just him reviving and drawing a bunch of cards. That's still annoying. In fact, it's very annoying. But it could be worse. What else is news? Well, I don't know why I should talk about news, because this is not going to go up into the channel until March, maybe. If it's February, then I apologize. Been wrong. The victory is yours. See, I just need Kelthazard. Oh my goodness. You know what? I don't even know if I'm going to buy Little Explorers. I might just buy the next wing of Nax. Because... Who is who is in League of Explorers? Let's take a look. Uh, solo Ventures. Okay, so we're current next. We started League of Explorers. Who is? Okay. Okay. Plus eight more cards. I see. I just really sort of want Reno Jackson, and the Scarab's pretty good as well. Uh, a bunch of the Discover cards can really turn the game on its head. That guy's alright. Like, he's a good 1-1, one, one, but you can't account for what hero power you're going to get. That's an interesting card as well. Your, see, your cards cost 5. That could be insane. Um, this guy as well is pretty cool. Like, if you can combo him in with Aviana, or like... You know, rogue. You get that artifact, then you play that card that makes your next spell zero. You know, she, she's there, the golden monkey. There's so many good cards, but reserved for the staff of an origination. Oh wait, I see. That means it. Right. Okay. But at the same time, Nax, right? So I've already done the first wing. Um. You know, got sl Sludge Belcher is very good. Unstable Ghoul is pretty good as well. She's a staple. However, it won't, these won't be in standard mode. Um, these guys are good as well. He's interesting. That's a good card uh, with Death Rattles, of course, because that's its entire effect. Kel'Thuzad is. Re Wait a second. Echoing Ooze. Why is that in Nax? I thought you started with that card. I'm pretty sure I already have it. Oh. I'm pretty sure he's not exclusive to Nax anyway. Maybe some of these cards aren't exclusive. These guys are also insane. Because, you know, if, they, if you compare these guys with Mr. Double Death Rattle, it's cute. But, um, that's what, 700, 1400, 2100. You're spending a fair amount of coins. Or you could alternatively spend 30 real dollars. What's heroic murder? Okay. Like, is there any reward or is it just. I don't think there's a reward. I think it's just hard. Yeah. Or oh, you could look at Black Rock. See, I already got the Grim Patron. What's. Yeah, some of these are alright, I guess. I mean, they're not as good as they could be. Is your Sarah in this? No. Flame Walker is very good, and Chromagus as well. This is see. This is what I'm talking about with editing. This is the kind of part where I just cut it out and be like, I then rambled for another ten minutes or something. But yeah, I don't know if I should get more necks or if I should just buy the first League of Explorers. Or, I could spend like, 20 something more dollars. Although, if I did, yeah, let's see, here's a, th I don't know. I can't think of like, a way to use Reno Jackson very well either. I feel like he'd be very good in a fatigue warrior, but, but, I don't have enough dust and, you know, I'm not attached enough to invest enough money to be able to just make a good deck that would require me to, myself, craft a whole bunch of things. 
coin, shield, and so Today I've actually seen a couple of those, uh, what are they called? The one that makes uh, people's turns only take 15 seconds. I've seen a couple of people play those. They can get pretty scary. But at the same time, yeah, they're pretty, can be pretty not a big deal either. It just means you have to, you know, think. Which will make it a little bit more difficult to record as well. Might just move the uh, microphone a little closer. There we go. It's fine. Clearing my board, but spending a lot of mana in the process and taking a couple of hits to the face. So that's not that big of a deal. Uh, yeah, let's do that. Punch the face. Good stuff. There we go. What did he just play? I wasn't paying attention. Oh, fan and knives. Okay. Well, I guess that means I played the Hector. Because I was going to play Iron Dwarf, but if he's got nothing to buff, there's no point. And this guy's got. This guy's a 5 4 anyway with Taunt. So that pretty much makes Gen's Shield Master sort of obsolete. I see. Oh my goodness, my spells that I obviously use so many of. Not on my watch. How good is just chucking a divine shield out? He probably had such high hopes for Lotheb. Although to be fair, the battle cry only really lasts a turn. But you know what I mean. Or you might not. I don't know what I mean, really. Um Tazdingo, yeah, he hiss. And what is he sapping? Heckla? He's sapping Heckla. Ooh, uh, let's see. Let's see. I could. You know what? I reckon I'm gonna play this guy. Uh, doesn't really matter who I give plus two attack, really, as long as I can attack that turn. Yeah, I'll play another one of those. Bam. 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 There we go. Easy peasy Korean. For the Lich King. He's annoying, but not impossible. Uh, which I think could be the name of my book. I'm not going to write a book. I'm too lazy. Uh, you know what? Follow the rule. Suck on that egg of wisdom. Bam. Bam. How's your 1 6 going? He's going good? That's good. Spectral Knight. Yeah. I guess he's good because I couldn't, like, target him with anything. Like an assassinate, for instance. Um, but he's not particularly scary. Okay. Interesting move. I suppose. Um. Done. Last warning. But, and I guess I will also. If I play him, what else can I play? Not a lot. Play this guy. I can use my hero power. And be mana efficient. Because if I play this guy, I have four mana left over to do what? Use a divine shield, which I'm probably not going to. Like, I could shield this guy, but that means that this guy would just then take it out and take him out. Make him a bit more of a target, really. Um, by having a divine shit. Right. Okay, no big deal. Maybe I should have divine shielded. That sounds like a lot, like a really good idea now. Um, instead, let's Divine Shield Ogre, play this guy, hero power, take out the, that guy so he doesn't become a big deal. We now have lethal next turn. Not a big deal, mate. And 
we must North, the also well. not a big deal. Where's that going? What's that doing? Does he know I have lethal? Do I have lethal? <laughs> yeah, I do. I do. Yeah. It's weird that he still like played his turn and finished it and didn't just forfeit. Oh, I was trying to end my turn. I was like, why are you throwing me on my turn? That's because I uh, I'd won.